Let's see how we can install Kali Linux on virtual machine or virtual box. First, go to this URL. I'll have this in the description below. Now, click on this virtual machines and see you'll see these options. You'll see 64 bit versions and 32 bit versions. To see which version you will need, press Windows R and type MS Info 32. Now, here you will see your system type. As you can see, I have x64, so I will download the x64 bit version. If you have anything other than x64, click on 32 bit. Now, click on this and your download will start. Once the download is complete, go to the downloads folder or wherever you have downloaded the file. Now, right click on this and extract it so that we can install it using VirtualBox. Click on extract all. You can extract it here or anywhere else. I'll just extract it here. So I did not have much storage left in my downloads drive so i moved it to this drive and unzipped it here so as you can see it is 13.7 gb so if you don't have much space in any of your drives just move this zip to some other drive and, and extract all there now once we have extracted our kali linux open virtual box and click on add now go back to where your Kali Linux is, go inside the unzipped folder and click on this dot vbox thing, click on open and as you can see this is the default configuration so we don't need to do much we can just click on start and now if you see here it will show you the message powering up VM our Kali Linux is there and it is loading. So I'll maximize this. So I've clicked the mouse and it will ask you this option. So just click on capture and it is still loading. So mouse will be unusable when you are inside this. You will have to just click control and your mouse will, will be available again. And once you click here again, the mouse click on capture or you can click this and click on capture and your mouse will be unavailable to external applications. It will just be inside this virtual machine. So if you want to do this, uh, if you want the mouse, you can just click on control again, the control that is on the left side and you will see the mouse again and you can do other stuff. Like go back here and go back to your virtual machine and again, go inside the screen and click again and you will see your mouse. Now, it will ask you for a username and a password. If you enter empty password and login, it will give you an error. The default username is Kali and the default password name is also Kali. So enter that and click on login. And now as you can see, we are logged into our Kali Linux. Let it open up. And yes, this is it. We are now inside our Kali Linux. Now you can click on this terminal and terminal will open and here you can write your Kali Linux command. So I'll just write, let's say, let's check the version. And as you can see, it will give you the version. And let's see where we are. And then we can do all the Kali Linux commands here. So this is how you can install Kali Linux in VirtualBox. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.